Hey, what's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here from GuitarJams.com. Uh, now, what I want to do today is I want to give you a super, super, super beginner lesson, uh, maybe even your very first guitar lesson, like something to work on if you can't play guitar. A chord is when you play more than one note together and you let them ring out together, a group of sounds together that sound good. A chord. So we want to use the very tips of our index finger and the very tip of our middle finger and they're going to be together like that like a scout's honor kind of thing or whatever we got them together like that and we're going to use the very tips my index finger is going to be on the second fret so look first fret second fret and I'm going to one two the second string down the very tip of my finger is going to go right there but I'm going to curve my hand underneath like I'm holding it, you know, like a, like a hammer. Okay, next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our middle finger and we're gonna put it on the same fret, which is the second fret, first fret, second fret, but that middle finger is gonna be on the third string down, right there, one, two, third string down. So remember that index finger's right there, so you gotta kinda figure out that finger can't be all the way up there and still get your middle finger underneath, so you kinda have to let there be enough room for both fingers to get on there. This chord has a name, it's called E minor. You know, we give letters to the names of the chords. This is called E minor. Now check out something else here with my, with my, left, with my left hand here. We don't want this part of our fingers on this chord to be stopping the other strings from ringing out. We only want the tips of the fingers on those two strings there, and then we want to be able to hear every other string open. So we don't want our hand blocking these higher strings so you don't hear them ring out. So there should be a gap. You're leaving a gap here so you can hear all the strings. Now you can pluck each note down, and that's a good exercise for your pick. And that first chord is called E minor. Now, if you strum through and you hear one note that's not ringing out, pick it and then look and see why it's not ringing out over there, okay? So that's your very first chord. Now, I'm gonna give you a little rhythm to try with that pick, and then I strum it, like a, almost like a paintbrush. See that, okay? And we're gonna start with two down strums. Down, down. And then we're going to add a little rhythm. So I went down, down, then I went down, up, down, up. Well, there's two really easy places you can go from there to mix up your sound and you're playing music. The first one's called, it's even got a really fancy name, A Suspended 2. But all it is is taking this E minor chord, which is You've got that second string down and third string down. You just take that exact same thing and scoot each finger down another string and you get a whole new sound. And you can switch back. One other place that you can go, and it's even just right in a Nirvana song, is doing this rhythm. But this time we're going to go to, uh, for for all intents and purposes, we'll call it a G. But what we're doing is we're taking that E minor chord and we're taking our middle finger off and we're moving it to the third fret of this top string. One, two, three. That middle finger comes off of that E minor chord and then we move it right there. And you can do that in any rhythm you want. So you're gonna be practicing where that index finger is staying and then you're moving your middle finger back and forth while that index finger stays. And it might sound familiar like Nirvana kind of. All right, that was it. I hope uh, you got a little something from that. Remember playing guitar just takes a little bit of patience in the beginning. Once you get over that first hump, like even if you could get 
comfortably through this lesson, it really becomes a lot more fun once you're just, even just with one or two chords, because you can actually play some music.